Meghan and Prince Harry's star-studded neighborhood has been hit by a chill discovery, local authorities have confirmed. Landscapers found human remains in Montecito, in the Californian county of Santa Barbara, last week, while working at an estate. While the exact address was not revealed, the area is located just 350 yards from Meghan and Harry's home, the Sun wrote. The workers unearthed the incomplete skeleton of a small adult. The bones were found in soil between two to three feet deep. They are believed to be of the Native American Chumash tribe that lived in the region from about 700 AD. Police called in a forensic anthropologist, who will determine the exact age of the bones. Santa Barbara County Sheriff's spokeswoman Raquel Zick said her department will launch an investigation if the bones turn out not to be dating back centuries. She added to the sun, we will have to get out our magnifying glasses. She also confirmed the discovery has no correlation with Meghan and Harry. Understandably, the discovery sparked quite a lot of drama in the quiet neighborhood, according to a source. They told The Sun, work stopped right away on the property and the cops were called in. It's quite a lot of drama for a place like Montecito. Meghan and Prince Harry moved into their home in Montecito during the summer of 2020. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex relocated to California at the end of March last year, a few days before they officially stepped down as senior royals. The couple spent the first few months in Los Angeles, at producer Tyler Perry's home, as confirmed by the Duke of Sussex during an episode of the podcast Armchair Expert. Speaking about the media intrusion he experienced in the city, Harry said, We spent the first three and a half months living at Tyler Perry's house. The helicopters, the drones, the paparazzi cutting the fence, it was madness. People's response was what do you expect if you live in LA? Harry outlined why he believed that was not a fair justification for constantly being under the spotlight. Confirming he and Meghan did not mean to remain in Los Angeles long term, he said, well, first of all, we didn't mean to live in LA. This is sort of staging area before we try and find a house. Secondly, how sad that if you live in LA and you are well known you just have to accept it. More to follow.